what's up youtube how are y'all doing today i am doing good what's going on oh jesus so i am trying to go get us some lunch and my key wants to cut up and so i haven't been able to because it keeps saying incorrect key so um i have to sit here and play with it because it's battery low and so i haven't been able to go get oops sorry radio um to go get the battery for the key because the dealership's closed so you guys, I hope y'all are doing fairly well. Um, like I said, I'm going to go get us some lunch. And I usually don't like going to this KFC because they're so rude. And um, and they always forget and stuff. Like, last time I went, they forgot my corn on the cob. And they forgot my gravy for my mashed potatoes. So, you guys, I mean, you're getting the bucket of mashed potatoes. So, who in the world is going to forget mashed potatoes? I mean, gravy. So, then I called when I got home. She was like, oh, we put the corn and the gravy in a separate bag. We forgot to give it to you. <laughs> well, duh, lady. And I told her, she's like, well, you can come back. I was like, well, I mean, by the time I come back, my food will be cold. And then, you know, then on top of that, well, we'll come up here and we'll give it um, back to you. So, I'm like, well, then what am I going to do with the gravy? Because I'll be done eating the mashed potatoes. So it was like, dang if you do, dang if you don't, if you ever heard that saying. So anyway, this time I will not pull off without checking the bag. I don't care how long the line is. You know what I mean? So, you guys, the county that we live in, they had um uplifted the stay at home order but you still have to follow the state guidelines which was the same as stay at home order but i have noticed some stores has been slowly opening up so i guess it's just time time after time or i mean day by day i mean um but i did which i don't know how true this is see where some count um states are going back to school i don't know if it's tomorrow monday or the following monday um so who knows guys but y'all make sure y'all keep being protected out there um actually i had found us um where we live this lady makes masks so i found um got us some but I have to go wash them bad boys before I put them on my face. Because she might have the coronas. But who knows, you know. But I am starting to think like my dad. This stuff is something like when the flu just started came, uh, came out. They didn't know what it was, how it was. Which I wasn't living then when the flu came out. So I'm just guessing, I don't know. So, I think this is something that's going to be here forever. Um, but, I mean, I could be wrong. I hope I'm wrong. Um, so, who knows? But, uh, make sure y'all get out there and y'all like and subscribe. Because, guess what? I got some popping news to tell y'all. I am going to be selling unique makeup. So, if anyone is interested, let me know. So, and I did it for you guys. Because 
Well, I guess, and for myself and my husband. Um, because I think you guys like my makeup videos. Well, so I ordered some. Um, but, hey girl, um, so, uh, like I said, I'm gonna be selling that, and if you're interested, please let me know, and tell me what you guys' favorite color is, like, what colors do y'all like to wear when y'all's face? Um, you ladies and for you men that are watching if you're watching um, what color do you like seeing on your mom your girlfriend your wife or whoever your sister so and maybe I can try and um, that is about it that I know of right now to tell y'all about the makeup. It's with Unique. I don't know if y'all have ever heard of it. But right now, I don't know how long it's going to last. I have to find out. But they have a thing where you can get buy two, get 13 free. Mm -hmm. Get it, girls. So, just let me know. Oh, and my son's birthday, my oldest son, is Saturday, next Saturday. He'll be 12. That's all I've heard about it for the last three weeks. My birthday's coming up. My birthday's coming up. My birthday. I want this for my birthday. I want that for my birthday. But, of course, that's any child. And, you know, I am kind of feel bad. I know my oldest um, daughter that stays um, with her dad um, she couldn't do nothing for her birthday because of this quarantine she turned 11 so it's just a mess I feel sorry for all the kids in school for graduate like I feel bad for the kindergartners because you know some schools do the kindergarten graduation um, it's their first year, so, you know, they're just getting adjusted, and then they was out, and so when they go back, it's, like, all over again, like, I don't know. Then I feel bad for the kind, I mean, the fifth graders, because they have fifth grade graduation going into middle school, which, um, two of mine will be, my two oldest two will be going into the middle school. Um, like I said, my oldest daughter, she stays with her dad. But, uh, um, and then I feel bad for the ones going from middle school to high school. The, what is it? Well, I know I had an eighth grade graduation. I don't know. Some schools go to different grade levels. Um, cause I know I have a nephew going into high school, maybe two, but I can't think right now. And I know I got a niece going in to middle school, or she might have already been there. She might be going to, I don't know, don't get me wrong, I got too much to remember these days. So, um... And then I really feel bad for the seniors because I ain't going to lie to you. That was my best year. I remember when my senior year, I would always want to miss school, you guys. And I missed the bus on purpose. And so but my senior year, I didn't miss a day because I wasn't taking them tests. So I'm at KFC. Let's see if they get it right, you guys. Um, so, you know, it is. So, I, like I said, I feel bad. So, I went to my son's school the other day, and it was like, they're going to try to figure out an online thing or something. That's not fun to me. Hold on, guys. Welcome back to KFC. 
Um, yes, I would like the $20 fill up. $20 fill up. Yes, and um, a, um, a corn on the cob. Okay. And a large Pepsi and a large sweet tea. Okay, is there anything else I can do for you? That'll do me. Okay, so it's going to be $28.27. Alrighty. So, I like this lady. She cracks me up on YouTube. I can't think of her name. I think her real name's Chelsea, but she goes by Tammy on YouTube. And she cracks me up when she makes her order. She'll say, that'll do me. So, it's stuck in my head when I order something. But, um, yeah. Like I said, I feel bad for those, um, those, uh, children i know my son i'm um he's ready to go back because he said this online stuff he don't get it i don't get it myself to me i'm like boy if you don't understand it how am i supposed to understand it i've been on school a long time sorry y'all i'm getting my gloves <laughs> you got to wear gloves around the chair So, we got the handy dandy glove. I know y'all think this girl, like, this girl's crazy in here. But, um, so, I really want to see if they get my order right, is what I really want to do. Um,. But I hope you guys are out staying safe. And I was telling my husband the other day, um, my mom passed away a couple of years ago. I think I told y'all this. Well, not a couple of years ago, Lord, a year ago, a little over a year. Um, it seems like a decade. I missed her so bad. Oh, it's gonna be 28, 26. Uh huh. Hold on, y'all guys. This shit comes $28. What do I get? Oh. Let's see. Oh, I forgot. Here you go. <laughs> there you go, girl. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So I got my receipt. I'm gonna put it right there. So, but she val died Valentine's Day. Um, is the gravy and corn in there? Yes. Okay, because last time they forgot it. I don't want to go home. Oh, you can double check. Let's see, there's the gravy. No. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh, yeah, it's at the bottom. Okay. Thank you. You have a nice day. Uh-huh. Okay. 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 So I just want to make sure.
And now I gotta take my glove off. And get my sanitizer. Ooh, y'all, I found sanitizer yesterday. Was it yesterday? The day before? And I was like, thank you, Jesus. They was like, you only can get one per person. I said, oh, it's for somebody else. I went straight to the dang self-checkout. Sure did, honey. Sure did. Oh, what was I saying? Um, I was telling my husband the other day that, like, I feel bad for all these people in the nursing homes and stuff. I know my mom, she, um, I think it was about a year before she passed, she had, um, fell and broke her ankle. And she had to have surgery twice. And, um, so, uh, on her ankle. And my sister would, one of my sisters, well, I think both of them would go. Well, I know one went more than the other one because the other one was working. Um, would go daily and, I know, well, I live an hour and something away. Which is not far, but it is far. Um, uh, so they would go, of course, more than I would. I think I went a couple times. But I don't know what done done or what. It would have drove up probably them crazy not going to check on her daily because one of the nursing homes they was giving my mom the wrong kind of medicine and caused her to get sick and was put in the hospital we should have shoot a uh, suit they tell but you know what i don't know if any of these anybody that is a lawyer or attorney or knows anybody but I want to ask you guys something, and if you do, let me know. But, um, my mom, the last eight months or so, probably longer than that, she was getting to where she would bleed, I think, once or twice a month. And, like, she would, like, when she go pee, she would pee, um, pee blood. And she would go to the doctor, and they was like, oh, it's a UTI, it's a UTI, and just push her off. So, this is no lie, y'all. About a week before she passed, she had told, of course, all of us. She, I'm, she called me. She said, hey, honey. I said, hey. She said, I'm a peeing blood again. I said, mama, you need to go to a different doctor. You know what I mean? Well, no, I'm just tired of going to doctors, you know. They push me away, and they keep telling me the same old stuff. And I'm like, well, Mama, I'm talking about, you know, not there. You need to go, like, to Baptist or Duke or maybe Charlotte. I don't know. And, uh... She says, no, I'm just tired of going to doctor. Now she gone. She gone. And she died of internal bleeding. And I think a blood clock in her lung. Don't get me wrong on that one. I might not be right. But I think I can sue them doctors. Because they just crazy. Honey, the speed limit is 35. I'm not going to speed for you. If you want to get a ticket, go right ahead. Spend your stimulus on your ch uh, ticket. Go right ahead, my friend. Go right ahead. So, um, anywho. Because I ain't spending mine on no ticket. Um, 
But my husband, we was at my mom's, and he was like, <laughs> he was like, I should. He called my mama Risa. He'd be like Risa, um, cause her name was Terry, but we called her her real name's Teresa. So he'll call her Risa. But um, he was like. I get to talk about mama. He like, uh, 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 don't talk about her. Uh, uh just uh, tell say Risa, leave me alone. He gets upset. Anybody he knows that passed away, it bothers him. So he says, don't talk to me about your mama. Uh, 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 uh I don't want to hear it. Talk to her about yourself. I don't want to hear it. And um, he be like, I, he said. One night we was talking because sometimes I can have moments where I can talk about her and be fine. The next minute I'm just in tears. But uh, so we was talking about her, and he'll be like, "I wish I would have picked her up and put her tail in that car and took her to Winston." And um, so I was laughing. I was like, "I would like to see. I would like to see that." Him trying to get my mama in this car. But, I mean, I kind of wish we would have done it. But the past is bad. The past is the past. She's not suffering anymore. And my son had a dream about her a couple weeks ago. He woke up. Now, y'all let me. This boy's five. He woke up. He said, Mama, I had a dream about my new Mimo. I said, you new Mimo? He said, yeah. Excuse me. I said, oh. He said, I said, what'd she say? Her love you. I said, she says she loves me. Yeah. And I said, oh. I said, what else? He said, her said her wanting to come back, but she can't right now. Or she can't. I said, well, she wants to come back where? To her house. You know where we went? I said, yeah. He said, but her can't right now. Or her can't is what he said. He said, because she's in the sky. And I said, like, yeah. And um, so I started crying. 